We're vending our product on Community Market Day. And I just came down here to support the Community Market Day. Build community and we get to engage in commerce together. My name is Brittany Ping. I live here in Manchester, New Hampshire, and I'm here at the Community Market Day to purchase um, some goods and maybe barter for some things for my home. I've been coming to Community Market Day for about a year, a year and a half maybe. I've seen it come from like a small, uh, like hobbyist kind of a venue to large um, vendor events. Just really cool growth and expansion. There's a lot of excitement around Community Market Day and sort of where it's come from and where it's going. Anybody who has some some service or anything of value is welcome here uh, to offer it for, for sale, for exchange, for trade, which is also cool. I'm a welder fabricator from Ithaca, New York, and I'm trying to sell some of my my goods that I create. What we're selling today, we brought uh, handcrafted, homemade, organic plant oil-based soap. Uh, along with our organic lip balms as well. If I came here to buy something through Community Market Day, I would look for uh, organic foods, farm food. My name's Kate and I'm selling applesauce, chickens, vegetables, it's all from Wild Heart Farm Set. I'm Emily Smith and I'm with Bardo Farm and we are selling our pasture-raised and free-range meat. We have an off-the-grid farm with 210 acres and we have been raising animals there for the past eight years and we also have gardens, we do maple syrup, we do emu oil. So we've got honey from our beehives, um, we've got some glazes and spice mixes here, we've got okra, eggplant. I wrote the sriracha cookbook and the veggie lovers sriracha cookbook. Um, I brought those for sale, I also brought some uh, items I bought in bulk. I think we're at a really critical time right now where more people are looking for more natural ingredients. I think more people are waking up to the fact that it really matters. When you can also buy nutritive foods from people uh, within your community, you're helping them grow their business, you're just putting a few extra dollars in their pocket, you know, for their families. One of the other really neat things about Community Market Day is just that you can sort of pay for things in, in strange ways. Of course we accept the fiat, uh, we accept Bitcoin, uh, we accept silver. My name's Caleb, um, I've been here all my life, I grew up here. I didn't know that there was this community of people that traded silver. We'll also uh, do barter and trade for it as well. I think people should come to Community Market Day because this is what we're here for, right, as part of the Pre-State Project, is to create communities. And there's no better way to connect with who your community is than to engage in commerce with them. If you want to find out more about Community Market Day, uh, there's a Facebook page called Community Market Day Project. Community Market Day currently meets twice monthly in Manchester with more marketplace locations now in the works for Portsmouth, Keene, Concord, Laconia, and beyond. You are invited to participate in this amazing operation as we co-create peaceful voluntary systems towards economic and health freedom. To see what more Free State Project movers are doing and creating in their communities, visit fspmovers.com.